Hi, welcome to my channel. Today, I'll show you how to use Google Cloud Platform with your static website. Let's start by logging in to your Google Cloud Platform. And let's go to Storage. From here, click on Create Bucket. This is where we'll upload our HTML site. Put your website name under name. Make sure you are putting the www or any subdomain of your website. This is important, otherwise it might not work properly. On my case, I'm putting one of my website called www.caninternationaltravel.com. A warning appears telling you that it needs to be a valid website. On my example, I know it's correct. For default storage class, I picked multi original. Multi original is the most common storage class for a website. You can also pick original if your website target is mostly local. For further details on storage classes, I've put the link below. For location, I'll leave it in the United States. Then I click Create button. From here, we are ready to upload the files. If you have multiple folders to upload, click on Upload Folder. Or if you have a single index file and few images, like me, then click on Upload Files. Select your files and upload. Now that we have uploaded our files, we need to make it available publicly by clicking on the checkbox Share Publicly. Do this to all your files. So we are done uploading the files. Now we have to point the index file to our website. Let's go back to the previous page by clicking on Bucket. On the right side, click on these three dots, then edit website configuration. Under the main page, type index.html. If you have a 404 page, you want to put your 404 page here. In my case, I don't have one, so I'll leave it blank. Then click save. That is it. We have successfully loaded our website to Google Cloud. Now, all we have to do is point our domain to Google Cloud by editing the CNAME of our website. In my case, my domain registrar is from Google. For other registrars, I've put the link below on how to edit your CNAME. Let's go to DNS settings and edit the resource records. Type www over here, then select CNAME, leave the 1H there and put c.storagegoogleapis.com. Then click Add. That is it. Now wait for about 30 minutes to an hour for your domain to propagate across multiple servers in the internet. For some, it might be more. For some, it might be less. On my case, I waited for less than half an hour and my website is ready. I can now go to caninternationaltravel.com website and this is what shows up. I'm just gonna try a different browser to ensure it's actually working properly. And it is. And that is it. Thank you very much for watching. Please hit like if this helped you.